to Warsaw Fan TV. It is uh, deadline day and uh, Warsaw have made their 11th signing. David Okagbu um, from Stoke played some time at Oldham. He's a, a right-sided centre-back with no league experience. It really does make you wonder what is going on. Um, why is he bringing uh, another centre half in, right side? If he'd have bought a left sided centre half in as cover for Hussey, perhaps that may have made more sense. But I think Harry Williams is the left sided centre half that um, was supposedly there for cover. I know he's been playing right side. <sighs> I have trouble understanding this one. We've already got a very young squad. Um, and how many defenders have we got already? That's uh, I know Matt Sadler was a defender, but with Rowling, he's uh, due back sort of October November time. I know Oshin McKenty is turning him into a midfielder, but we've still got lots of cover in there. The priest, um, we are gonna have to rename him again, I think, to Lord Farquhar. Because it seems he's far, far away. Every time we talk to Matt Sadler, oh, yeah, he's uh, he's not far away. He's not far away. Well, that's been going on for weeks. What's happening? I'm a bit, um, I'm a bit down by that, to be honest. I think we need some more experience in the team. Um, at the fans forum. Um. He talked about Oshin McKenty saying now he wanted to get him back into midfield and turn him into a midfielder. He's really pushing his way forward, Matt Sadler, to um, intent on turning Oshin McKenty into a centre midfield player. And then on the right side, not bought in a dedicated right wing back. Uh, we love Tommy Knowles. And he's done a good job there, but he's not a dedicated wing back. He's very good going forward, but uh, defensively, you can only get by so far. Joe Fawkes come in and done a very good job um, for his tender years. But again, he's more of a right back than a right wing back. But talking with uh, Matt Sadler at the fans forum... Um, he didn't seem over keen to be experimenting with the back four, which would make more sense with the players we've got. Um, Joe Fawkes would be much more comfortable playing right back. So would Joe Riley, and uh, Joe and uh, Tom Knowles would be much more comfortable playing as a right winger, which is his role. We're going to delve into all of this. We've got a, a fan chat. We're going to do that on Sunday night. So uh, hopefully we'll be boosted with some positivity from a win at home to Colchester. We certainly hope so. Uh, we'll be looking through the summer signings and um, what what you guys think about Oshin McKenty. Is he going to make a midfielder? Tom Knowles, can he fulfil that right wing back role adequately? Seemed like Matt Sadler just wanted to get Tom in the team wherever, rather than uh, perhaps setting up the team to get the best out of him. Let's just have a look through quick. I'm only going to make this a short one. Uh, Ryan Sturk was our first signing. Um, been pleased with him. He's good, showing good promise. Chris Hussey, despite his sending off, has looked good. The Priest, Lord Farquhar. We haven't seen him. Uh, Douglas James Taylor. It seems like he's going to be bench warmer again. If he gets on the bench. DJ. Great addition. Can't complain there. Um, number six was uh, Freddie Draper. Freddie Draper has uh, been good. He's coming good. I know he is. Um, Harry Williams. Didn't expect to be playing. But um, he's put some decent performances in. But he's a very young lad. And uh, he's in a very inexperienced group. 
And uh, I think with him preferring the left side of centre back, he has actually been playing out of position in his first few games in the AFL. Um, Jackson Smith, um, I know Jack mentioned that uh, he would slot in, but from what I've seen of him, he's nowhere near ready to take Owen Evans' place. Um, 9 and 10 was uh, Ross Tierney and uh, Aramidi OT. Aramidi OT must be chomping at the bit for a start. He's been doing well. And Ross Tierney, he's looking better. He's looking better. And now, this David Okagbu, he's not going to play. He's not going to play. I don't see the point. Harry Williams is the young development player. So, um, what's the point of um, having him, having a Kagbu? It's not like we've got a reserve team he can be playing in. He's not going to get any game time, is he? The uh, the boys from Oldham, where he uh, spent nine games and scored two goals last season, um, say so he's maturity beyond his years. But uh, at 19... Right then, hoping for a morale boosting win tomorrow. We hope so. Wolves Fan TV, the frustration and the elation. Join the pain. <laughs> Cheers, thanks for watching.